Hello there. Alright, so I've had multiple people say that they kind of wanted to just see me do QA, do my job. Um, I can almost guarantee you're not going to like watching me do my job. It's pretty boring, but, um, you know, I guess give the people what they want. Um, and by say people, I mean like the three people who've asked me. So, uh, but, you know, who knows? It might be kind of interesting. Just a heads up, though, I will be like pausing on and off, and I probably won't be able to show you my bug, the bug tracking software we use, just because it's a uh, kind of like got people's names in it, and I don't want to expose people's names that didn't agree to be like on the stream and stuff like that or on the recording. So, um, but yeah, I will be pausing here and there just to you know be able to converse with them and stuff. So, okay, so currently I'm actually trying to track down a bug that I had seen right here. Uh, basically, whenever using this item, I think it's Cursed Potion, might be what it's called. Yeah, Cursed Potion. Um, so basically, when you use it, the VFX that played kind of stuck around. You know, not great. Uh, usually, if I were doing a debug build, I would just use debug commands to give myself the item. But I'm actually testing in a, um, in a release build, so can't exactly do that. And I have the music turned off, so... And I'll tell you what, if you, you just audio designers or designers or whoever out there, or even, you know, I guess, you know, QA, um, if you really want to see how good the audio design is in a game, uh, turn off the music. And if it sounds like devoid of life after that, then it's probably needs to be punched up with some more audio stuff. Let's just grab all this. And hopefully I encounter it. And also, if I see other bugs while I'm gone, I'll, I'll check it out. There's actually another bug right now that I'm trying to uh, narrow down, but I just cannot seem to get it to reproduce. Uh, members of the community found it. Basically, what it was is um, is uh, whenever you go into the shop, there's a shop in the game. If you go into the shop, it'll actually have a uh, all the items missing, um, which, you know, isn't super helpful. Kind of just have to pay attention to this. I can't talk and play at the same time. That's way too much pressure. And this game is ridiculously hard for some reason. Um, but that's just me. Uh, I was told that this I might not be the audience for this game. Because it is hardcore, son. I'm actually testing on two different screens right now. I'm testing a different game on a different screen. How dare you make a punch sound effect at me, sir. deal with some frustrating issues but we are back every now and then you'll get those developers that kind of just don't bother reading the entire bug before you know getting back to you and asking you a bunch of questions like hey it's all in the bug bro but that's all right i think everybody's guilty of that at some point like everybody has a point where they're just like oh, i'm just tired i just want to power through this i'm sure they didn't get this information and you just kind of power through and don't really read it i get that it happens to everybody Gosh, I hate the, the dots in this game. They're so frustrating. It's a neat game. It's a fine game. Zoetti. Tis a fine game. Don't know why I turned into Old English there, but you know what? Let's roll with it. I shall cutteth thee, sir. Uh, taketh that. Yeah, there's just a ton of debuffs and in this game and you're constantly getting hammered with them by the enemy that the ton of debuffs and a ton of buffs for themselves so it's like it's really difficult to overcome a lot of these fights this one's not too bad this is like one of the regular ones but there's some of the boss fights that are i mean understandably pretty difficult i get that you kind of want your boss fight to be difficult some of them are ridiculous i've had a lot of coffee in case you can't tell 
I'll probably get super self-conscious and actually not post this. I get super self-conscious about my my work. But there's a lot of like really weird bugs um, that are hard to nail down in this game. Get frailed, ye. I think it gets stronger every time it gets hit, so. Boop, boop, boop. Yeah, it has a, where is it? Yeah, um, and there's like a thousand different, yeah, take a look at all the, the, um, the buffs in this game. Like, the game literally locks up when you're trying to open it. There's so many different buffs and status effects and stuff. It's a lot. There's status, status effects that cause other status effects that cause other status effects. Like, it's pretty silly. But you know what? Hey, like I say, I'm not, I, I've been told I'm not the, uh, the core demographic for this game, so and I totally understand that. Okay, back to it. Yeah, I get pulled aside a lot. That's why I, one of the big reasons I don't do this is because, or do the uh, recording and doing my job is just because it's a, uh, I'm getting pulled aside a lot. I mean, it sound like I'm getting in trouble, but you know, that's not too abnormal either, to be honest. <laughs> A lot of times I just like to sit here and like milk this guy for money because a lot of times he has that golden blessing as part of this boss fight. Pretty cool. Like every time you hit him, it gives you another stack or gives him another stack of this, and after every uh, round, it gives you that money. Also, it's uh, the game is a lot of like sort of rhythmic, I guess, not rhythmic, but just taking turns sort of thing. Like uh, you can do anything on any turn, or you know, do anything that you have the cards for. Um, but the enemy tends to walk, go back and forth between attacking and, and sort of buffing itself. So a lot of times you kind of have to learn the rhythm of uh, sort of defending yourself on some turns and then attacking on other turns. Because you don't have the card. I'll often do not have the cards to do both. I don't know why I'm getting into the design of it. You guys don't care about that. You're here for QA. Um, hmm. Yeah. Part of me doesn't want to hit him very much just because it'll make him last longer, so make him survive longer, but yeah. Need to move on, find that bug, son. That's one thing that I do like to preach is like it's not you know, a lot of times in QA it's hard to say, Alright, I'm playing the game. Like right now, like right there I was like, Alright, I wanna get more gold and stuff like that. But that's not really uh pertinent to what I'm trying to do at the moment. So like if I ran into a problem I need to just probably very left. Um turn that down. Wow, there we go. It's probably a lot quieter for you now. All right. Anyway, um, but yeah, sometimes you have to sort of like draw the line like, all right, I'm testing or I'm playing. Sometimes you catch yourself playing and that's that's fine. You know, it's going to happen whenever you are okay with the game. Um, but yeah, it's it's uh, not always that easy. Hang on, pause again. All righty. Revenge plus two. Ooh. I can't remember what that does. I think that's if you get hit, it gives you a attack buff, temporary attack buff, if I remember correctly. Okay. This is the shop I was talking about. Like, so basically the bug is sometimes you'll come in here and like these will all be missing. And there's a also a shop that you can get to uh, whenever you're out in the field that has a different character. And then like both characters will be displayed here. It's a, a little bit of a mess, but that's why I'm trying to find it. So how was your day? Wait a second. I don't care. I don't know you. You don't know me. I'm just killing time. Making conversation. Max doubles the number of room stones. Wait, what? Hmm. That's a pretty cool item, but it will hurt you. I haven't taken damage yet, though, have I? Oh, never mind. This is what that explaining. Never mind. Oh yeah, yeah. Sometimes this game, man. The yeah, mini flush. Target afflicted fail and increase to fifteen instead. I'm good. I can just do this. 
Oh, I'm going to be one short, or two short, I mean. I'm one card short. One card short of a Zoetti deck. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. Pew pew. But up and up. And I'm not going to be like spoiling any events or anything like that. I'm just going to skip past a lot of them. And it's not because I don't want to. It's because I basically don't want to spoil it for you in case you guys do want to play the game. Yay, I did no damage. Huzzah. Um, yeah, that's a bit of a bummer, especially these two together. It, see, this one gives itself 30 armor at the end of every turn. This one gives itself 20 armor at the end of every turn. Oof, that's rough. That is a lot of armor to try and cut through. A lot of armor. Got him. All right, cool. Yeah, take that. Actually, kind of wanted more damage to go to this guy, but what ebbs? Mm, that's tempting right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but that'll kill my max health. Hmm. Something to consider. Yay! I cured him. I'd probably want to use this uh, during the last boss fight of a run. If I know I'm going to win. Getting ready to win. Yummy ouch. Boom, boom, boom. All right. I could meditate here and spend some of my gems but I actually think I'm going to hang on to them and then double them in this fight no, don't be the spiders don't be the spiders don't be the spiders spider shit alright let's do this um, let's see gosh I hate the spiders alright And just like that, I have no cards to draw next round. Yay! And no defense. Oh, well, defense from my shield, but that's it. Okay, why is it zero twice in a row? Hmm, that sounds like a bug. Hmm. I may have to look into that. Let me check the replay on that. And uh, I use OBS, actually, to record long form. So I'm recording regularly but i'm also using the uh, replay buffer as well so i can just push a button and then bam there's my replay all right so i have eight move my turn hmm hmm i think that's supposed to go away um 
card draw during next turn. Yeah, I think I think that's a bug. I feel like I'm understanding this properly. Am I not getting this? Am I viewing it incorrectly? All right, so I use that. All right, I have my negative eight. Use that. Yay. Okay. That was my negative eight. Uh, no, that's right. Actually, I don't think I've... Yeah, that was the turn. Okay. Yeah, I'm mistaken. I am mistaken. It happens. I get easily confused. What can I say? Pew, pew, pew. And, of course, that allows them to stack, like, ungodly amounts of, like, debuffs and shit. Okay. That, I feel like I should have drawn that time. All right. Let's go ahead and long form that one real quick. Um... Yeah. Negative eight. Drop all those. So it lasted two turns, basically, is what it seems like. I'm going to investigate that one a little further. Um, card draw debuff didn't. Or lasted too many turns. All right. Yeah, I like to just label them exactly what I'm looking for. That way I can come back to them later. But, um, yeah, that one's a bit funky. I need to look into that one a little more. That definitely seemed wrong, so I'll, I'll poke at it some. Makes me think that if you take it all the way down to zero, it doesn't cleanse properly or something. I don't know. All I know is it does not seem to be working. That seemed iffy. To say the least. Gosh, they're just killing me four cards. Good God, I really hate that debuff. Basically makes it to where you can't play the game. Like, oh, you wanted to, you know, play the game and have cards to play in a card game? No way. You're asking too much, sir. Too much. Uh, I just know if I do that, it's going to screw me over. Because if I hit, I'm going to take away their temporary card draw weekend. Oh, yeah, yeah. I really don't like that. Okay, this is probably my last chance. Okay. Ooh. Close. I didn't want to use that. I didn't know if it actually took... I think it just just the max damage, but still. Was... Yeah, I probably should have used it. Oh, well. Oh, well. That's okay. Hopefully there's a place to meditate. Campfire within the next uh, map. Uh, this is actually a really cool item, but it doesn't really explain it very well. It's like after 13 shuffles overall, not 13 shuffles in a match or in a combat. So if you go like five rounds and yeah, you know what I mean. If you're going throughout the map and you had to hit that, it's rough. Uh, hand limit, draw three cards. That's pretty cool. Um, hand limit two. Yeah, I like keep flight. Let's do this. Still need to find that item though. And hell, I already forgot the name of it. Um, Cursed Potion. That's right. So much coffee. That astral devil. Okie dokie. Let's keep on trucking. I don't get the explanation of a lot of these things that say at the start of battle, strength plus one. Like, it's it's something that lasts throughout the whole battle, so it doesn't really need the quote at the start of battle. They could say, you know, strength plus one. Okay, I did not take down my actual health. Ooh, that's a lot of power you're going to be trying to bring on me there, buddy. Boop.
this ability is an absolute nightmare gash so basically if i attack right now it will every time i attack it'll double so and isn't, i'm not talking about doubles in like add three and three and three and three no it's like six and then 12 and then 24 like it's so if i right here this three times it'll it'll yeah it'll hurt but if i kill him it doesn't work yay but yeah, you can't dodge against it, nothing. Like, you literally have no defense against it whatsoever once they put it on you. Your only thing you can do is turtle up and hope that it doesn't do enough to get past your shields. Like, it'll actually get past your shields, but hopefully it doesn't do enough damage to actually straight up kill you. And then the enemy get past your shields. It's a pain. Gosh, no camp. Dang, that sucks. But then it'll do that damage to you at the end, which is, um, you know, rough. Perseverance. I cast Perseverance. It's sort of effective. Yow, 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 ouch. Yow, 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 ouch. And this Jagaloon is putting Evade Aura on everybody. Probably should have focused him first. Gosh, it sucks. Ugh. Never mind that. Pretty much the only thing I could do. Oh boy, this isn't looking too hot. God bless it. Yeah, and I think that's going to kill me. Yep, that, this run is over. Boop boop. Alright. Continuing on. I guess if I were to write up that other bug. Um, yeah, I don't know. I, I don't want to reproduce that a few more times. Which means I have to go fight those stupid spiders again. Look, hate fighting those friggin' spiders. I think it's this one. A sweet lady. The quest givers call a sweet lady. Boop. <sighs> okay. Do that, 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 boom. Right. So I think it's kind of weird about the enemies in this game is they just kind of perpetually get stronger and stronger and stronger. It's like for, for no rhyme or reason. Like they'll have an attack of like doing nine and then four rounds later they're doing like 30. I'm like what in the world is happening? And sometimes it's buff, sometimes it's just because. Like why? What? what's the point of showing me all this? You know, <laughs> what's the point of it being that wild of a swing all the time? I'm bitching too much. I actually like the game. Problem is, whenever you're this close to a game and you're making it, like you're working on it all the time, all you could see flaws everywhere. It's like, yeah, you see, whenever someone's like making their way through the game casually, they kind of just see like the the flash and you know the awesomeness and all the cool stuff that's happening. But once you uh, start actually working on a game, like you'll start to see, ah, oh, man, I really wish we could have changed this. Wish we could have changed that. It's it's a pain, but you know that's what I try to tell tell people that. Uh, you might not like getting into game development because it can totally ruin game development for games for you. It can once you see how the sausage is made, there's no unseeing it. And eventually, your eyes just kind of like see all of this differently. Like you may see like a character standing on a field, you know, in a grassy plain. All I can see is like this is a one image. This is a sprite. These are different uh, different sprites that are set up to you know play like the wavy effect. There's another sprite in the back that's doing that. This is a completely different image. These are different from this, you know, and 
this is an image and all these yeah it's like you totally see the the parts of the game as opposed to the game itself like you'll never be able to sit and see a character hit the ground with a sword and sparks fly out and like you no longer see a sword hitting the ground with sparks you see a model hitting the ground that is triggering a vfx to play um yeah you kind of it's i love it don't get me wrong i love you know my job i love doing what i do but i will caution people that it can completely change the way you look at games i don't say you want to still appreciate them I, i've used the word ruin before i probably shouldn't but it makes you appreciate them in a completely different way victory i'm gonna turn the music on i feel like this is too boring without the music oh that probably shouldn't happen. I'll bet you that's going to screw something up. There we go. Hopefully you guys can hear it okay. I'm not sure if you'll be able to or not since I got the game's audio turned way down. Return to game. Nah, I don't touch you. Trust you, Rebel. I draw and frail for two turns, temporary card drop plus one, draw two cards. Alright. That's gonna go on you though, because you get trying to do damage to me. Pew pew pew. This is like kind of a crappy full house ability. Ugh, <laughs> oh, so much armor. Jesus. Oh, shit. I probably could use that armor. I really hope that's not too loud for you guys. God knows I would hate it for you to be able to hear anything other than me. That was a rough turn. Trying to keep an eye on my other game, too. It's a chore to try and test two games at once. Although, when I say test the other game, I'm not really kind of, quote, testing it. Um, I've got it set up for my PS4 test kit and the... Uh, Sony actually has a really cool, I mean, not wonderful, wonderful, but they have a, you know, pretty darn good, you know, set of development tools that come bundled with a, a software package for, for Sony platforms. I'd say of the three, that's probably the best ones that I've run into of the big three uh, manufacturers, Nintendo, Sony, Microsoft. Microsoft's isn't bad. Nintendo's is eh, not great. Target manager. It's okay. It's, it's, it's serviceable. It's just got some issues. Goodness, I wish I could reproduce that friggin' shop bug, because that's actually been driving me crazy for like three days. Still didn't happen. Darn it. I'm not sure what I need to do. Right now my theory is that uh, if you... And it's probably wrong because it's a really wild stab in the dark with nothing to back it up. Um, is if you buy all of the items from one of the field shops uh, that whenever you 
get to the regular shop, it'll it'll bug out. But that is just a wild idea, you know, guess on my part. My whopping two damage got him. Gain all the frails. Every now and then you get a run where like the skills you're given are basically just... I need to switch over to attack skills because I've just got a crap ton of defensive skills right now. And that does not exactly do me a lot of good. And then the defensive skills I have aren't like armor. It's like reduce their attack, which, you know, well, it's fine. But if that's all you have, then you're going to get attacked a lot and it's not going to be great. Like you can reduce their abilities or reduce their attack, but it's not going to like reduce it to nothing. Although there is a skill that'll let you do that. That's just not hers. Pew. Aha, I gotcha. Yay. Oh, brother. I actually like defensive stance. It's not a bad ability. Comes up pretty often. I've actually never tried uh, Heavy Blade very often. I'm going to try that. Defensive stance. Come here. I like you. Alright. Why in the belly? I don't think I've used this one very much. Revenge. Alright. Even if I haven't used it very much, that's all the more reason to use it more. That's the thing is, QA, you got to dig into those things you haven't done. Like, hey, this thing hasn't been used very much at all. Oh, well, I guess someone should use it a lot then. As bad as if this shop bug does happen again, it's I'm going to have no idea how to reproduce it. I'm gonna. That's why I got the long form recording, is I uh, so I can like sit there and reverse engineer what happened. I just sit there and uh, watch the video, and then uh, hopefully I'm able to sort of like sit there and write down. All right, what happened immediately before the bug happened? All right, you know I, I don't know, sold not sold. You can't sell anything. Um, you know I, I did this kind of map node. I did you know uh, what you call it like an event node instead of a combat node so and then like all right try that that's obviously not it all right what did i do before that well i had an event node with the camp node right before it so you're gonna have to sit there and reverse engineer uh exactly what's uh what's going on and sometimes that works sometimes it gets frustrating and doesn't quite work and you have like 30 steps of the you know, you reverse engineered since before the bug yeah I'm one short of being able to meditate one of my abilities, one of my passives. One gem short. Mm, spiders. I hate fighting these guys. Alright. Um, Temporary card draw enhancement. I'm trying to get my temporary card draw down like a lot, and I just used an enhancement ability because I'm smart. Pew. Alright. 
Huh, it didn't st oh, because it ran out. All right. Okay. Not going to be able to get it this turn. Yeah, it's getting ready to cast it on itself again. There we go. All right, so we have three. Okay, so we're down to zero. So that means next round we should draw zero. Okay. Cool. That worked as designed. Hit the button again. Huh, worked fine this time. I don't know. I'll have to reverse engineer that one too. Find out what's going on. Pew. <laughs> this is gonna be close. Oof. Barely made it. Okay, yeah, let's upgrade chop. Alright, so we'll, you know, uh, try to reproduce. Didn't exactly work. I'll have to reverse engineer that one too. Just re watch the video and try to figure out what was going on. I don't know if I want to do that here on stream with you guys or not. But we can give it a shot, I guess. Alright, go and mute Zoetti while I'm trying to figure this out. Whoa, what just happened there? Alright, cool. Alright, I've got the 8. In turn, there's my 0. Oh wait, this I've got it split up into two different videos, don't I? Hmm. Um, shoot. Don't think I have it long enough. Because, like, I've got it on the long recording, but in order to do that, I would have to stop this video. <laughs> and uh, that means I wouldn't be dreaming of you guys. I guess I could stitch it together and, and friggin' Da Vinci, but... Man, do I really want to wait for a render? Like, a friggin' hour-long render? I don't know. But I do have the recording that I will review later. I promise I'll review it. I don't know how many abilities I have that actually use charge. Nope, you write the book. Okay. I don't know that I have any abilities that do the charge. Nope. Oh well. dogs laying on me. It's freaking cooking me. Jesus Christ. Anybody who has a lap dog could probably attest that, good lord, they can put off a lot of heat. I want to see if the average temp body temperature of a dog is like a hundred and something degrees. Like low a hundreds, obviously, but could be wrong. That could be just an old wives' tale. Average dog body temperature. Ooh, 101 to 102. Bam! Looks like that was correct. I like being right. That's just not a good full house ability. Burp. Ugh, bite. That's another rough one, but at least you can put up armor for that one. Oop, gotta be right back. My other game crashed. Okay. Still got to process that crash, but that is not within the scope of this video. Yeah, at least you can put armor up against bite. It's reasonable. Gash, on the other hand, is pretty unreasonable. But again, I am not the core demographic of this game. I don't really like super duper punishing games like that. Just kind of, I don't know, I find them, I don't know, I guess I've dealt with enough frustration <laughs> in gaming that I don't want to deal with it anymore. Uh, I'm not sure what to, how to put it. It's like I've just dealt with like hard games my entire life and I'm 39 years old and I'm kind of done proving my, to myself that, oh man, I'm really good at video games. Like I'm 
I don't, I'm not I'm done with that. I do not have a chip on my... Curse potion! You got to win it. Bam. Even though I want all this other stuff. I'd rather have this stuff. Alright. We can only go to the idol. Alright, let's go to the idol. Skip. Um, I don't like offering soul stones because that's what you use to upgrade stuff. So we'll just pray and get an item. I don't I don't wanna I don't wanna spend <laughs> soul stones, please. Alright, let's go use this cursed potion sign. Make sure, finally been friggin' forever trying to get that friggin' thing. To reproduce this very simple bug. Skip. Um I guess a defense accessory. Oh, I like that. It's a good one. Although I would call that more of a offensive ability. I might actually go ahead and snap a replay of that and put it up. Because every now and then whenever you run into those issues where it's like not quite a bug, but it's also kind of weird. You can usually put those up and, you know, the developer will mark them and be like, no, we intended this, or nope, definitely not supposed to be this way. Um, alright. Oh yeah, reproduced, son. Alright, so at least now we know that is happening the way we, way we intend. Um, haha, you'll never be able to do damage to me, and by never I mean till next round. Yeah, let's hit you with some fire damage. Hmm. Gotta take 10 damage on this one. Yeah, defensive stance. Oh, the guy should have been paying attention. He's not even gonna attack this turn. Brah. So many numbers there. <laughs> hmm. Dang, son. Get worked. Goodbye. All right. Um. Yeah, I'm still rocking chop. Why not? Okay. Let's get this bad boy posted. Uh, where was it? Cursed Potion VFX. All right. So I'll put it in a uh, Word document first. So, because I don't want to, I can't really show you guys my uh, bug tracker. Oh, and this right here, this is a, a clipboard manager called Ditto. Um, I, if you work like in an office setting at all, I recommend getting a clipboard manager. Uh, Windows has one built in. I think it's Windows H? Nope, that's not it. Uh, Windows J? I don't remember what it is. Windows K? No, that's not it. But anyway, um, there is a, a, a Windows version of a keyboard or of a clipboard manager, but it's kind of eh. It doesn't. I don't think it saves between reboots, and it doesn't save a whole bunch. But Ditto, on the other hand, saves like however many you tell it to save. So it can save like 500, 5,000. It can save a lot of stuff. But anyway, I'm getting distracted. Use Ditto if you work in an office. No, I'm not being paid. All right. Uh, let's do the description. Um. The effect. Uh, so I, I like to put tags on the front of my uh, descriptions just so it's easier to search for and know what's going on. But you can also, I also have a search terms field. But I like to put it up here just to sort of, uh, before they read the bug, they kind of have, get in the right mind space. All right, what exactly is it they're looking at? Um, it kind of sort of helps uh, them sort of guide their, their uh, thought process to where I kind of want it to be. So uh, this is in combat. It is a problem with a VFX. The VFX for Cursed Potion will not, uh, well, I mean, it's like delete itself or destroy itself, but uh, let's just say disappear. Disappear um, after being used. I really don't need the after being used, but I feel like it's really, it's too short without it. It's like, the VFX for Cursed Potion will not disappear um, after being used. Uh, why, why not? Why not? All right. Um, media example. Here's where. Actually, I'm going to upload the clip. 
and show you because our uh, bug tracking software actually can't handle any attachments bigger than I think it's like five megabytes. So I've got to upload them to our Google Drive and then get a link um, from Google Drive and then put that in the bug. So you got to work around, you know, you know, you're going to have limitations no matter what you do, no matter where you're at. And that's a weird limitation that we have at this this place. So. All right. Um, obtain. We probably don't even need steps for this, but we're going to put them in there just because. Obtain a cursed potion item. Enter combat. Used the oops, use the cursed potion. Results. The VFX for the potion does not destroy itself. Oh. What I do? Oh yeah, sorry, I didn't put a period on it. Actually, I don't even like having periods. Don't tell me what to do, word. The VFX for the potion does destroy properly. Um, we don't really need anything in the notes. It's pretty pretty self-explanatory. We don't need any search term. See the video attached for res. I don't really need that anymore either. Boop boop boop. All right. And let me go ahead and copy this over to our bug tracking software. And actually, I gotta get that crash posted still too. That's not a good one. That's an ugly one. But that's in the other game. I'm not showing that game right now. That game is not top secret. In fact, it's already out. But we are working on some stuff. All right, let me go and reread this real quick. Uh, the VFX for cursed potion will not disappear after being used. Blah, 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 blah. Obtain a cursed potion item. Um, enter combat. Use the cursed potion. The VFX for the potion will not destroy itself. The VFX for the potion does destroy properly. Um, I don't really like this sentence. The VFX for the potion is destroyed. How about this? Is destroyed. Is destroyed. Yay. All right, that's better. I'm going to copy that over now. Bam. And I'm setting on my other fields. So we have status, which, you know, I don't mess with. It's a new bug. That would be like the, you know, closed, fixed, all that kind of stuff. Priority, uh, I'd call this one pretty low. Um, at least at this stage with the game already being out and stuff. If I were early in production, earlier in production, I would definitely put it as like a medium because that's pretty ugly. Uh, let me see it as a graphical error. Uh, so category, we have things like animation, audio, all that kind of stuff. Um, assignment, who do I assign it to? That is one of our developers assigned it to. The platform is like Steam or Switch or what have you, but Steam. I know you guys can't see any of this, I'm aware. Um, and then the watch list. I want to put myself on the watch list so I can keep an eye on the bug. And there we go. It is posted. Bam. Okay. That's it for that bug. Womp. I'll take a rare accessory, please. Evade equal to the number of items held. Evade goes away after the first friggin' turn, so noob. Um, after using an item for the first time, I like that. Well, only for the first time, though. Um, these friggin' items always cost, I'm sure. Yeah. That's a pretty good, pretty good ability though. 60, man. I kind of want to see what happens if I try to spend it without having the money. If it'll work for me. Or if it'll work, you know, trigger. Oh boy, alright. Um, yeah, I'll take that. It's fine. No, oh, yeah, we have already have one, so have thirty. Boom, 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 boom. Hmm. I can use this drug. Can be activated four times against you. I'm using what? Um. Okay. After. Okay. I know. Serpent King. Let's do this. Oh, and I already posted. Uh, whenever you're choosing something, it says tap to choose a reward. When you know we're not on a platform that has tapping or on PC, so I'll show you again when I see it. 
And it's still not broken. Darn you for not being broken. Uh, yeah, let's purchase that. Just so we make sure we got a little amount of money so we can test out this, uh, this item thing. The Danettis Dancing Shoes. Oh, I need to make sure I have them equipped. Oop, that's not the right thing. Return to game. Uh, items. Let's get rid of you. Get rid of you. Or put you on. All right. You and you. Cool. I like that. Select. As if I have a choice. Ugh, these forking guys. Ugh. All right. So I don't have enough money. All right. And where is it? Uh, 60. All right. Let's see if I can do these. Uh, yeah, seem to work. Um, yeah, all right, cool. Took all my money, but that's pretty much what we expected. If this is of all the things that it could have done. I feel like it. That's probably the cleanest. Uh, I hate these guys. Uh, yeah, temporary strength weaken. Womp, 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 womp. All right, in between. Yeah. Get fort. Ooh, my one damage. How lovely. How OP. <laughs> Ridiculous. <laughs> oh, brother. All right. Um, all right. You're going to be doing freaking 25 over there. Good Lord. I'd say they just get stronger and stronger and stronger. They buff the hell out of themselves. It's rough. And they can do all kinds of stuff in the turn. Like, I basically am pretty limited in what I can do in a turn. Alright, that's 12, so we're good there. Ugh, one. Well, I guess I can't kill him. Boop. Sweet. Oh, hey, we're buffed up now. <laughs> Ridiculous. <laughs> All right. Yeah, there we go. Get poisoned, son. Eat my poison. Gobble it up. All right, lady. Bug some thump something out, damn it. All right. Uh, Blade of Eternity. I wish I could afford that. That looks good. Um... Usually if it has that gold outline around it, it's usually pretty strong. After using skills, deals damage to a random enemy equal to the number of cards used. Ooh, that's a really good one. I wish I could have that one. 420, yeah, blaze it. And 420 gold. Jeez. Like I said, if you're bored, sorry guys, this is kind of boring, I'm sure. To watch me do freaking QA. Ugh. Can't imagine a more boring thing. I feel like that's good for a spider fight. Thirty six. Woof. That is yikes. That is a little scurry. Oh boy. <laughs> it freaking just ate the, my, the bite. They do everything. Good lord. Yeah, I might be screwed here. This isn't good. I didn't mean to use that, but why not? Because I'm getting ready to die anyway. Ooh, barely survived that. This is probably the one time I have one chance I have to get this thing done. Or no, I've had. <sighs> okay, well, he's getting ready to apply more bite to me. Probably don't need that much, but there you go. It scares me. 33. Oof. 
Oh, man, I lucked out there. Bam. Suck it. Yeah. That was a close one. Okay, go away, ground news. Dang. Uh, you know what? We're going to go down here and try to get a little more health. It's one of those instances where, you know what? It's okay to play the game right now. <laughs> um, let's see. Gosh, not a lot of options here. Wonder if I have any more abilities now that use the charge. I shouldn't have taken that ability before if I didn't have, you know, skills that use the charge. Charge plus two, all right. Now, this is confusing too because uh, there is charge, which is uh, like a, uh, a buff, but there's also her uh, Valentine's ability, which is not a buff, but it's called, I think it's called like, it's charge something. Uh, but it uses the word charge and it's very weird to have both of those. I like this one. Armor mastery is a really great skill. Let's you keep some of your armor between turns, which is amazing. I'm not sure if I'm going to survive this. Come on. I'm also trying to track down a bug where, uh, try to track down another bug where it's the loading screens get like set steadily longer and longer the longer you play. Um, it's kind of weird, but I'm trying to track it down now too. I think that's all there is to it too. But the thing is, like with a memory leak like that, it's really hard to sort of track down exactly what's causing it. I mean, I posted the bug, but at the same time, it's like, okay, sorry, this. It's basically me saying this bug happens. Good luck finding out why, kind of thing. And that sucks. Like, it sucks for the developers, it sucks for me, it sucks for everybody involved to post a bug with, like, that little bit of information to it. Like, nobody wants that. I don't want to do that. I don't like posting those. Num num. Okay. Gosh, I'm weakened again, of course. Always and forever, it seems. Haha, your puny 13 can do nothing to me. I probably should have used this first. Boop. And boop. Damn it, didn't mean to do that. Shit. Um, hmm. Oh, shoot, I didn't realize he had that on him. Uh, what does he have on him that poisoned me? Why did I get poisoned all those times? Hold up. Why did that poison me? Hang on, we're going to watch that back. Oh, here, i got to mute it real quick. All right, let's watch that back. That was interesting. Okay, let's look at this. All right. Does he have... Oh, he does have the freaking little golden spider thing on him. Crap. All right. Okie day. Um, I'm going to leave the audio off for a little bit just because I'm concerned that you guys are having trouble hearing me. Potentially having trouble hearing me. That's going to hurt. Oof. Yeah, poison, there's like nothing you can do about it. It's just like it eats through you. You're, you're just going to have to deal with it. Going to have to suck it up. Uh, you know what, why not? Boom. Hopefully I get something better. And dead. Yep, nothing I can do about it. Poison just kind of goes behind your armor and poisons you, I guess. Kills you. <laughs> what an appropriate name. Cool, cool. Well, um, I know you didn't get to see a whole lot today, but uh, this is more just like a test to see if anybody would actually even give a crap about me doing this. Um, 
which I'm going to say no. This will probably be one of my least liked videos ever, but you know what? There you go, no matter what. Anyway, uh, thank you for watching. If you do did manage to make it this far, you lunatic. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one.